Once you receive your new ROTAP device, some initial setup is required to get you up and running. In this video, we'll walk you through the necessary steps so that you can begin using your ROTAP sieve shaker safely and efficiently. Let's get started. Hello, I'm Candace from WS Tyler and I'll be your ROTAP guide. Getting a new piece of equipment for your lab is always an exciting time and we want to be there to help at every step of the way. Each ROTAP package you receive will contain the WS Tyler ROTAP unit itself, some replacement parts so you can maintain the unit, and any test sieves that you may have added to your order. Depending on which unit you select, the weight of the unit will be anywhere from 90 to 180 pounds, so it's highly recommended that you have a second person help you lift the ROTAP out of the box. Once you and a coworker have lifted the device onto a secure table or sound enclosure, it's time to bolt it down. Due to its unique oscillating motion, the ROTAP may move from its original position over time. The next step is to check and adjust your hammer height. It's important to make sure that the hammer height is at 1 and 5 16 of an inch in order to yield accurate testing results. This can be accomplished with a T-square. The final steps are quite easy. Add your test sieves with your sample onto the ROTAP. Plug in the device, set the timer, and let it run. Any questions or problems setting up your ROTAP, we're available to assist you by phone, email, or the chatbot on our website. If you'd like to learn more about particle analysis, Click the link in the video description to access our Learning Center, which is full of helpful information designed to help you become a particle analysis expert. To keep up to date on all things WS Tyler, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon next to it. Until next time, I'm Candace. Have a great day.